Sorry, guys. I just was putting on Do Not Disturb because I realized I forgot to put it on before I started the live stream. But hello, happy Sunday. I hope everyone is doing well. I'm clearly still getting situated here. Um, I hope everyone is having a good Sunday. Um, I'm chilling. I woke up kind of late this morning. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm thriving. I have a big glass of water here. And today's show is going to be um, styling a full, like, cozy look. Um, I realized that in most of my fashion shows on Bear Shop, they've all been like, uh, um, like dresses and kind of more event styling. Um, so everything today is for like, yeah, just a cozy look in, perfect for Sunday. I'm obviously leaning into my cozy vibes today. And also, um, if you're new here, hi, I will introduce myself. My name's Alyssa and I am Little Virgo Bean on Instagram and also Vera Shop. A lot of my shows are around pastel style and pastel fashion, um, but I'm obsessed with all things kind of colorful and really uh, pastel, so that's perfect. Um, let me just, I guess I'll just get into it. Um, I don't have too much to go through today, but whatever, we'll just start. Um, I'll start with like the shirt that I'm wearing it is actually part of a, hold on, I'm presenting it now. It's actually part of a set that you can purchase the top and bottom separately, which I really love because when you buy things in a set, it really bothers me when you have to pick, or can only pick one size for both top and the bottom. I always am different sizes in the top and the bottom. So it's nice that these aren't, you know, you don't have to buy them together. Um, <clears throat> this is from the brand Siho or Sijo. I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, but literally this like pajama set is the most cozy set I think I've ever owned. <laughs> um, it's the material is so soft. I wish I knew or could remember what the actual material was, but it's seriously so soft and stretchy. Um, and obviously it's a, um, it's like this really nice kind of sage green color, um, which I'm so obsessed with. I'm really, I feel like sage green is going to be a huge, um, kind of have like a huge resurgence in the early fall that with like chocolate brown. I feel like those are going to be the two it colors, but I've been really loving a bunch of, um, you know, sage green things. And I absolutely love this top. I feel like even though it is soft enough to wear to bed, it is, you know, really, really cute. <laughs> so you could wear it out. I definitely will wear it out. Um, like, I just know that I'm going to be lazy one day and roll out of bed and it'll still look cute. And I could just change my bottoms and go out with it. I like to style it like how I'm wearing it now. Um, I don't know if you guys can see or if the product details are like right in front, but I'll stand to show you guys. I style it like this. So I like to tie a little um, bow in here, or not a bow, tie a like hair tie and wrap it um, just so it's a little bit more fitted. I feel like it gives it a nice, um, yeah, just like a different kind of look that I really love. Um, and then I always pull the sleeves up as well. Just, I don't know, it makes it feel like more lived in, but I absolutely love it. Let me get, show you guys um, the matching pants, which I'm not wearing them today just because it's, we're having, I mean, it's always a heat wave here in LA over the summer, <laughs> um, but it's getting really hot again. I think today is probably going to be in the 90s. So I just didn't want to sleep um, in pants last night, but they are really, really light and breathable. I also did just wash them too, which like 
I'm glad that I'll be able to speak to this now because sometimes I feel like when you buy really, really soft fabric, after one wash, it like loses its softness. And I feel like these literally get softer which, with each wash and the material feels super high quality. So your washer and dryer, it's not gonna, you know, like destroy the softness early. Yeah, like I said, quality um, of the pant, which is really awesome, especially considering the higher price point. It's like, you know, you want those PJs to last a while. They're really, really cute. I got my top in a size medium and the bottoms in a size large. Um, and I actually feel like I should have gotten the bottoms in a size medium too because they're the large is like a little bit big on me. But since, you know, they're just pajamas, I would rather have them be big than too small. Uh, they have this really, really cute pocket or two pockets in the front right here on the sides you can kind of see in the picture and then because they're joggers they're like you know that tighter around the ankle style um but they're so they're just like so soft and cozy I really really love them um everything today too also if you're new I feel like this is worth saying everything today is going to be um 15% off for well throughout the duration of the show and then for up to um, 30 minutes after the show. So if you want to like, you know, think about it or whatever, <laughs> you totally can. And yes, for up to 30 minutes. If you're just joining now, um, what I was just saying is everything today is going to be 15% off um, throughout the show. And then yeah, for up to 30 minutes after. And so the two items that I just showed this um, is the jogger pant. Um, it's super cute. I was saying I just didn't want to put it on because it's super hot in LA. But the thing is, this fabric is so breathable and stretchy and nice. And um, because these are a higher price point, I don't know, I feel like it's really reflected in the quality of the material. Um, I also did say that I washed these, both the top and the bottom, um, one time. And so I feel like that's a good test to test the quality of the material. And it's still just as soft, if not softer than when I first like originally got them. So I absolutely love this set. Um, once again, it's by Sejo. I think it's the name of the brand. I don't really know how to pronounce it, but I know for sure that I'll be looking into more of their stuff. Um, I think they do like high quality um, home and also lounge wear, you know, that sort of thing. So let's just move on. I'm going to fold these and put them over here. And then to complete the cozy look, this is, if you want to look like me, it's like, you know, the just rolled out of bed look, but a little bit put together. Um, I have this really cool makeup item, which you can probably see on my face, um, is the fake freckles. These are by Pseudo Labs, and I've showed these in a couple of my shows before, but I'm like finally now starting to get the hang of how to put them on my face. I mean, I still feel like it looks a little bit like dirt, um, but I think it's really cute, and I've just been wearing these every day, but I think like um, it's the perfect kind of compliment to a natural face. My favorite thing to do is to put on a ton of blush underneath my face and then put these on top and it sort of gives you the best like sun-kissed look ever. So I'm going to put more on my face. The thing about these that you have to be careful with, for some reason every time I put these on my face it drips, like the product just drips really easily. Um, you can't really see it, this is what this fully looks like. And I don't know how it happens, but literally every time I come, like I walk away with it all over my, I don't know, hands or just honestly, I've seen it on the mirror. I'm like, I don't know how it got there, but whatever. Um, yeah. And then the other thing too, I usually like, I'll show you, I'll just like pop a couple on. So they come out like that and you can leave them dark but I usually pat them in um and then it like helps spread
spread the freckle and makes it look kind of more natural. Um, but totally up to you. I've seen people do this sort of look where they pat in the freckle. Um, and then on top of it, they'll just like go in with another layer. Here, we'll put more on. Um, they'll go in with another layer and kind of just like leave it like that. So it's, you know, you know, like real freckles are, they're kind of like, they all look different. Um, so that's, this is a really, really fun product. And honestly, one of my favorite things that I've tried in a long time, um, because I feel like it's, you know, unique. This is by Pseudo Labs. I can't remember if I said this. And this is the freckles kit <laughs> in shade one. Um, I'm going to pop these in because I just, they feel like they're, they were standing out too much. Um, yeah, this is shade one. It comes in three shades. Um, I feel like these are perfect for my skin tone. They don't, they like blend in really well and they're not too dark. Like I said, you can get that like varied variation of shade range, I guess, when you pat it down or if you just like leave it on your face. Um, the other thing though about this, I find that at least here in LA, these don't last, like they smudge really easily. Honestly, if I took my hand and just like went like that, they would all wipe off my face. So if you're like planning on wearing these to an event outside, just know that they probably won't last as long as you want them to. Um, but I also don't wear like a setting powder typically, like sometimes I do, but not, not a ton. So that might help. <laughs> help or putting on a primer first um, but I just find that like they just wipe off super easily but that's also a good thing because since they are a little bit messy to put on I've made so many mistakes <laughs> like putting these freckles on my face and you can just easily wipe it off like you can kind of tell on my nose that was a really sloppy job I did there um but whatever it's they're freckles so it's supposed to kind of just be whatever on your face um, this today with the 15% off is 3230 and originally retails for 38. So I don't know, I feel like this could be a fun gift for someone or like if you're thinking about trying the fake freckle thing, now could be a good time just because there is the discount. Um, but yeah, I love <laughs> this product. It's just, I don't know, so fun. I'm going to show you guys this spoolie again. And basically I had, it was a little bit hard to figure out, but I like, I just take it kind of at a, what is this angle? I think like a 45 degree angle against my face. And I basically just press the side of it against my face um, instead of doing it directly on my face like spots because that comes out too much in my opinion. Um, but yeah, so that's my favorite makeup product for sort of like, you know, just a cozy, natural look. And then the other two products that I have, one is a home product, um, but I included this in my show about styling a cozy look because this product, it like will elevate your whole game. It is a detergent, but <laughs> I smelled it. I like wish you guys could smell through the screen, but it is a detergent from my favorite brand. Well, it's um, a collab from my favorite brand and then this other brand called The Laundress. Um, but my favorite brand is La Labo and they're known for making really, really high end um, scents. I have a couple of their perfumes and they're all just like really luxury and uh, just, I don't know, they're just really, really nice expensive scents. And this one, they do have this scent in a perfume. It's one of my favorite perfume scents, actually. It's the Rose 31 scent. Um, but I was so excited when I saw that they came out with a detergent because I just, like, I'm obsessed with all of their scents. Um, and this one makes all of your, you know, clothes and sheets and linens and stuff smell like Rose. I feel like I was looking to try this for so long because like I'm honestly really excited to try it on sheets and to see if you know my sheets actually do end up smelling like rose but 
the thing about La Labo is because they are so high end and so good at uh, scent creation is I really feel like the scent is actually going to last on your clothes. So to wash your clothes in this and then, um, you know, put on, put them on just kind of gives it more of a cozy, luxurious feel when you smell like rose. Um, all of the Labo stuff is made in New York City, I think. Um, and yeah, this is the size of the bottle. I'll show you. I'm trying to see. Okay, yeah, it's 16, 16 fluid ounces, um, which I feel like is small for the price that you're paying. But if you know the Labo, then you know that they're that they're sort of just a luxury brand. Um, it originally retails for forty five dollars, and then with the discount, it is thirty eight twenty five. If you're interested in trying. Um, rose is one of my favorite scents ever, and the thing that I like about this rose is I feel like it's um, not too heavy, and <laughs> I mean, I was going to say it's it's very floral, which is obvious, I don't know, that's obvious because it's rose, but <laughs> um, I find, I don't know, rose can be a hard flavor to lock in sometimes, um, and you can really smell the difference with high-end, like high-quality rose scents versus cheaper rose scents. And this definitely is more of an elevated rose scent. Um, I'm just reading the bottle. It's non-toxic, biodegradable, allergen-free, um, no animal byproducts. So that's all really great. Here's the bottle. Like I said, it's 16 fluid ounces. Um, I'm, yeah, I'm just reading. Basically on the bottle, it says to wash your, like your sheets and lingerie or anything really delicate with this, um, because it's like a very sensual scent. Um, and yeah, it's from the cult Lalabo brand. Um, so if you're familiar, then you know what Lalabo is already about. Like I said, I have so many of their products and I'm fully, fully obsessed. And then the last product, I, I went through those so fast today. Usually I'm like scrambling at the end, but this is the last product that I have. And then I'll go through everything once more, um, is this T3 round hairbrush. I was just brushing my hair earlier this morning, so there's some hair in it, but um, this is what it looks like, and I love these the T3 um, brushes, and I also have a T3 flat iron, I believe, um, but this is so good for, like, blow drying your hair and then, you know, doing a little curl at the bottom of your hair. I also just like to use these for as brushes on my hair just in general I don't know why but I do um and yeah I didn't use it this morning um because my hair wasn't wet <laughs> so well I used it to brush my hair but I didn't use it to curl my hair this morning um because my hair wasn't wet and I just put dry shampoo in my hair but I'm gonna brush out my hair right now it's very, very cute. It comes in a whole bunch of different sizes too. If you look on the Bear Shop app, they have um, they have like a big one. I can't remember. Um, I think it might be like three inches. This one is volume 2.0. So I, I, I don't know how many inches this one is. Um, but I remember when I looked, this was like their middle size one. I have pretty thin hair, so a big, a big curly, curling brush wouldn't really work for me. So I really like this size. Um, I feel like it's a good standard size for, I don't know, everyone. But if you have thicker hair, maybe go with the bigger one, you know. Um, it's really cute. And I feel like T3 just has the best um, hair products. Like I said, I have their 
flat iron and I, I don't love to straighten my hair, but it always works really well. And I feel like they're killing it with all the hair products they're putting out. Um, really love it. Um, I love running this brush through my hair. My hair is kind of dry right now because I, like I said, I put dry shampoo in it. It's a little greasy at the top, but it just brushes out my hair so nicely. And again, it's the, um, the, like this shape of brush is really good for curling your hair. If you want to blow dry it when it's wet into a curl, I'm pretty excited to try that with this brush. Um, so yeah, give it a try. That's really all I have today, which is honestly crazy because like I said, I always run out of time at the end and today I just finished early, but I'm going to go through and show you guys all of the products that I have today. Just going to have some water because I'm thirsty and tired. Also, I don't know if you hear my cats, but they're running around all crazy. They were meowing a second ago. Okay. So, um, well, first is the top that I'm wearing. It's it's literally so soft. It's the C, C. Joe, um, uh, like eucalyptus set. Literally the softest material ever. Um, so comfortable, stretchy, but also like flattering. I like to style it. I said I like to style it like this. Um, so I usually just take a hair tie and pull it together and like loop it in. You can see the little hair tie there, but the way I fold it, you can't see it from the front. Um, it makes, I don't know, it just makes it look, you know, more of like a purposeful daytime outfit. But if you're actually wearing it to bed, obviously that doesn't matter. Um, this is in sage green. I, yeah, I'm wearing um, a medium. I really love the way it fits. I feel like it's perfect on me for going to bed. It's fitted enough so that if I wanted to style it, you know, during the day, I absolutely could, but it's comfy for bed. Um, and then these are the matching pants that go with it. Um, so soft. The one thing I will say, my cats love to jump on me and sit and, you know, they do their like kneading thing that they do. So this material is really, really delicate. Well, that's actually not that delicate, but it's like that soft, stretchy material. And so it already like snagged in a few spots because of my cat sitting on my lap. So, but they literally always do that. I guess that's just the life of being a cat mom. But this is uh, the pants. They're so cute. And then they have these two pockets on the side. I, for reference, I'm a size six in bottoms. Um, and I got a large just because I wanted it to be more oversized, but if you're just joining now, um, I was saying I would probably, if I were to order this again, I would get it in a medium because I feel like the large is a little bit big on me. Also, I'm I'm five eight and a half, five nine. So if you're just thinking about, you know, sizes for yourself, hopefully that's a good reference. Um, it has this elastic waistband, and like I said, it just it was just a little too big for me. And then like baggy here in the crotch area. Um, but I do, I love the color and, you know, it's just, they're just being worn to bed. So I don't really mind them being too big. Um, oh, I already, I already, oh, actually, yeah, I can. I, we used to not be able to present it twice, but I think I can do that now. Hold on. Um, oh wait, that's the long sleeve. Sorry. Um, here are the pants. So, um, yeah, here are the pants. They're very, very cute. If you want to check them out, I just presented them on the screen. Um, and because there are joggers too, the bottom is like, you know, tighter on the bottom. Um, but that is that. I do want to move on um, so that I can show you guys just briefly the rest of the stuff if you're just joining. Um, but, yes. I will represent everything. I think that's a new feature. Um, okay. So this is the Lalabo detergent. 
I'm so excited to wash my sheets and my PJs in this and just like smell the rose scent on me and just like crawl into bed at the end of the night. Um, I love a Labo. I don't need to go into that again. It smells so nice. Um, and this today is going to be $38.25, which honestly, like it is expensive for the 16 ounce. Like it is just detergent. But if you know La Labo, you know, that's a deal um, because their products are just really all, all high end and luxury. Um, I want to present on my freckles again that I'm wearing on my face. Um, earlier on in the show, I put some more on so you guys could see how I apply. It took me a while <laughs> to figure out how to correctly put these on my face without looking like it's just dirt. I still kind of feel like it a little bit just looks like dirt, but I also love it. And I've been wearing them every single day um, and just kind of getting more used to fake freckles on my face. They're really, 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 really cute. Um, and I highly recommend, this is like literally my new favorite makeup product ever. Um, and I just, I recommend this to everyone. Um, these are on sale with the 15% off at $32.30 and they originally retail for $38. So that's a steal. And then lastly, I was just showing off, hold on, the T3, um, hairbrush that I think is going to be perfect for blow drying my hair and doing a little curl. I also, I do use this like as a dry brush when my hair is dry I just I find that these brushes just work best on my hair I think my hair is like pretty thin and I don't know I'm more easily able to just like drag it through this way um and not feel like I'm totally destroying my hair but I really love um t3 and uh this today is going to be $29.75 originally retailing for $35 so that's also a seal um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for joining. Um, I'll be back next week, same time, 10 a.m. Pacific on Sundays um, to show you more of my favorite stuff. Next week, I think I'm going to be doing home stuff specifically, which I'm so excited for because I love, I love sharing pieces of, from, you know, my home. And yeah, also I say this in every show, but Veritop is honestly one of my like favorite online retailers ever and they have so much cool stuff if you're looking literally for anything they have it on Vera Shop, and it's cool because they carry you know like all of the best brands but they have a really good range from like affordable to luxury so you can look at you know both ends of pricing um and kind of determine like what you want but it's cool because you know, you can likely find affordable, affordable versions of really nice, like expensive things, which is really cool. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Like I said, if you're thinking about um, getting any of these things, the 15% discount lasts for up to 30 minutes at the end of the show. Um, and if you have any other questions, like in the meantime, for me about any of these products, you can DM me on Instagram, little Virgo bean, or just, you know, check out some of my other collections on my Vera Shop profile page um, on the Vera Shop app. And yeah, I just highly recommend you uh, browse the app too, because there's just so much cool stuff there. So thank you so much for joining. Um, I hope you guys have a great rest of your Sunday and see you next week. Bye.